So we've just had our first NT Thunder under 18 remote camp, um, which was a fantastic opportunity to see some of our remote talent from all over the territory. The weekend consisted of a whole range of activities. So the first night we had some team building activities where we got to know some of the players, they got to know each other, and then they got to watch a little bit of NTFL finals out on TIO1. From there, we went into an induction process in the morning where we did some testing, putting them through the rigours of an agility test, but also looking at their height, their weight, all the things that I guess at the AFL they'll need to have on record for our, um, for our programs and that sort of stuff. But also it's important for us to get a real picture of what sort of talent we've got that we can work with. Um, from there, we had the uh, Defence Force Recruiting come in and run some sessions with the girls. They looked at building leadership capacity, um, looking at different group work, team building, that sort of thing, which the girls absolutely loved. They really got into it. From the Saturday night, we went into our Sunday morning game and we played against an under 18, under 15 combined team out at Nightcliff with some Wanderers players as well. And uh, yeah, we had a, we had a great um, experience for the girls where they got to go and play. It was hot, it was very humid, it was tough conditions, but they all played really well and I got to ID some talent. So essentially, the camp was all about getting the best out of them on and off the field, getting some education into them about their mindset, their well-being, nutrition, training expectations. But of course, the pinnacle or the icing on the cake was the game. And they all got out there. We had plenty of goals kicked. Uh, great opportunities to take some speckies off backs and things like that. All the, the things that you see out in remote, we saw on, on the day. So this weekend we had our first camp and next weekend will be the men's under 18 NT Thunder remote camp where we'll get to see some of our talent in the men's space. Uh, from there I'm going to, along with Jason Rowe, our head coach of the NT Thunder Boys Academy, we'll then select some players to come into our final squad with uh, consideration to potentially play in some of our NAB League games come April. So an exciting opportunity for our remote talent and I can't wait to see them out there, hopefully on the field here in our second NAB League game when we have a double header in April.